there are some um, popular myth about natural hair that we're going to debunk today like guys i've heard this so many times and some of us might have also heard this while growing up so we never even bothered ourselves about growing longer hairs or anything like that but um one thing i want to say is that i've learned a lot in the past two years of taking care of my natural hair and i want to share with you guys some of those things which we're told while growing up or you probably heard while growing up and i'm also going to tell you guys what i actually did with regards to this uh, myth uh to actually start seeing the result that i'm seeing in my hair right now so one of those things you probably have heard is that black hair don't grow so i personally used to think that our hair can grow past shoulder length like guys <laughs> that is what i used to think so not because i heard them say black hair don't grow uh but because i i think majority of the people around me were people that had maybe um shoulder length or ear length like i had never seen someone with hair past um, shoulder length we can now see evidence with people of color that are growing their hair way past uh, waist length, butt length, even tie length, even some up to their knee length. Like guys, it's so, so crazy, like guys. But the truth is our hair does grow. So uh, we've missed out on that because we failed to realize the techniques and all the things that are needed to really take care of black hair. Also, some of us might not see actual length of some um, natural hair because of what we call shrinkage. Shrinkage makes it difficult for you to see the actual length of um, black hair because our hair tends to shrink. And so it's only when you do maybe a blowout or a sick press that you can actually see the true length of black hair. So um, a lot of us have really long hair but shrinkage makes it difficult to see that and shrinkage is actually a good thing guys shrinkage is a good thing for black hair because i love the way our hair stretches you know the versatility of our hair how it's able to stretch and bounce back to its original state and all that i really really do love shrinkage but i know a lot of black people don't like shrinkage they they want their hair to be stretched at all times and i think that is probably one of the reason why we you know started using relaxers and all that your hair is beautiful and don't believe anything about uh your hair not being able to go past certain lengths i've been able to debunk that myth by taking care of my hair the way i never did before and right now i'm mid back length that is brow strap length which i never thought would have been possible before so guys your hair grows just do the right thing and you will see your hair in its full glory so number two a myth that we always hear about is the fact that natural hair is so hard and difficult to manage especially the type 4 hair like guys i was that was one of the reasons why i really relaxed my hair back then when i was younger you know i felt my hair was so hard so difficult to manage each time i went to make my hair i was in a lot of pain because i felt this is how her hair used to be and then i just went to relax my hair but right now i can tell you guys that the reason why our hair felt so hard and difficult to manage back then was because we never knew the right way to handle our hair. Right now, I can say my hair is soft. My hair is easy to manage. Like you guys see me take care of my hair. You see me braid my hair, twist my hair, wash my hair. I don't have that feeling that I used to have while I was young. That feeling of pain as if my hair was difficult and hard because most of the things that was done back then was that a lot of tension was applied to our hair making us feel that was the only way our hair could grow by applying too much tension but right now we know that tension is an enemy of the scalp you don't want to apply tension to your hair um do too much tight um, hairstyles that is going to even make your hair not to grow having noticed that i haven't tried all these possibilities i've come to see that my hair is so so soft like guys look at my hair my hair is soft it's not hard it's not difficult to manage you just have to know how to handle it how to handle your type of hair it's different from the way you handle people with straight hairs so you have to handle it with care with a lot of love and also you have to use the right tools to take care of your hair 
and also the right product like back then when we make our hair we don't have water we don't moisturize it there was nothing as such so how do you expect your hair not to be so hard when there's no moisture there's no you know water to really soften the hair we just go straight ahead and just use combs to just you know comb our hair dry so that was the feeling of pain we were feeling back then and made us conclude the fact that black hair is very strong but right now i'm telling you guys that my hair is so so soft and it's also easy for me to manage because you know i make my own hair so it's easy for me to manage so these are the two common myths about natural hair that we always hear but i've learned one or two things i mean over the past two years i've been caring for my natural hair and that is why i want to say it all starts with the mindset we have to have a mind shift from the negative things we used to hear about our natural hair and start thinking positive about our natural hair so if you don't do that it won't matter if you have the best routine or the best hair product the negative will always have huge influence over the positive things so that is how the mind works and that is how i've been able to you know grow my hair past what i used to have back then i really want to encourage you guys to have a good positive mindset about your hair and that your hair can go way past beyond what you actually expect it to do stop uh, being part of those people who always blame their hair not going on genetics and all those excuses they give just because they don't want to take care of their hair take care of your hair take care of your crown it's your crown it's your glory god has given it to you i've seen a lot of people with long 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 hair and i'm also growing my hair long and i'm going to grow it as long as possible debunk all this myth about black hair is not true and we have seen proofs i hope you guys enjoyed today's video and i have learned one or two things about this please let me know in the comment section if you're familiar with some of this myth and all other myths that maybe you have heard while growing up as a child or as a teenager and all that thank you guys for watching once again please like share and subscribe to this channel if you are yet to do so i'll see you guys in my next one bye